hits him pretty good on the sideline. What happened? Uh, say it again? A couple games ago, you were wincing pretty good on the sideline. What happened? Um, I mean, I don't really understand the question, but... You look like you're in pain. Oh, uh, well, no, nah, nothing seriously happened. Just uh, hit my funny bone and kind of took me out for a couple of plays, but I was good. It's nothing to be here, you're the team funny man. Mm -hmm. You do the best impersonation. Uh, I don't know. That's what they say. So I'm, yeah, it's probably true. <laughs> <laughs> Where do you pick up a Ray Charles impression? Uh, watching the movie. Just something that I have seen a couple of times and caught on to. Same, same thing they Joe had. He never <laughs> smiled that way. Was really for him. <laughs> He told us we ought to get you to do a few minutes of him. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> uh, not going to do that one. <laughs> Is it better than Ezel? Huh? Hmm? Is your impression of saving better than Ezel? I don't know. Um, hopefully, before I leave this place, you guys will be able to <laughs> figure that out. <laughs> what, uh, yet this late in the season, have you got, uh, Special teams pretty much figured out now, uh, except going clicking pretty good. Oh yeah. Um, well, we, we still got a lot of things to work on on special teams because we let a 82-yard kickoff return by Odell Beckham happen uh, this past weekend. So we got a lot of things we got to fix uh, coming into Mississippi State because they do take a lot of pride in their special teams as well. So we got to fix and correct what we got to correct, and we've been doing that uh, throughout, throughout the week. So. That's one thing that we've got to get back and taking pride at, at the, it's the kickoff and kickoff return units. But other than that, our special team is doing pretty good, and we like to keep pushing it and, and making the corrections on that so we can get better. Speaking of the return, kickoff returns, y'all y'all were taking some out pretty deep this week. Is that a? Um, I think we only took one out that was deep. That was the first one, which, which should have been neat down, but you know, just flood the game. Um, but it wasn't anything that you know that held us back from doing anything. So. Wasn't a problem. Is that your, I mean, your complete, have complete uh, discretion on that? It's up to um, you what to do. Pretty much. Coach Saban trusts me enough to make the correct calls, um, which that call I should have, I knew in my head I should have needed that one. But, you know, you, you learn from each play and which we could have got a better field, field position if I would have needed. So, with the, uh, the penalty, 10 yard penalty we got to put us on the 10. So, if I would have needed it, could have avoided all that, so it was just a lesson learned. Are you, are you on the coverage team as well? Oh, uh, yes, sir. What's, what's been the difference the last maybe two or three weeks? Um, nothing much. It's just uh, running down, playing fast on the kickoff unit. That's what you got to have when you're playing on the kickoff unit. So we haven't really been playing fast. been kind of like today because some, at some spurts of the uh, kickoff unit uh, times when we're out there. So I think when, when we get out there, we have to just always play fast and know our lanes. And I think that'll cover everything and help us be able to get our goal on the um, kickoff unit.